Hey guys, so we're going to do a review of UTV um, kit suspension seat. I uh, hope you guys like it. Like, share, and comment, and subscribe. I wonder what this is. Hey, we don't know, we'll see. <laughs> That is his suspension seat! Yes, baby! Yay, yeah, Oh, All right, move the box out of the way. Mini suspension seat. Look at that. Just in get in. Oh, yeah. Oh, this fits him perfectly. Look at that. Bless me, seatbelt. Yeah, he's gonna have harnesses. So I'm gonna come over this way and go come through the regular seat and then through his seat. Then down here. Yep, and it'll come through down there. Oh my god. Yay! I've been waiting on these. I'm actually really happy. Like their turnaround time I paid on Friday. They sh and today's what, Thursday? They're definitely faster than PRP. Well, unfortunately, they can't have RC either. <laughs> what you think, Woogie? You ready to cheese? You gonna be able to go deep it now? So the, this little seed is mainly for off-roading. Um, for yeah, when we go a, wheeling. A, that's what it'll be used for, is for off-road wheeling trips. Mm -hmm. Because he can sit in either a bucket seat with a harness, a grown a person's bucket. bucket seat with a harness. You put this inside that same seat, and then the harnesses will come through here, around the lap, See and me. the fifth one will even come up through there for a five-point harness. Mm -hmm. And... It makes it to where he can sit in a harness seat, a five-point harness seat, and it not be too big. It's mighty perfect. That's me. It's finished. So these seats, I found these on Facebook, and I've done my own research, and they came from UTV seats. Get one of these for Christopher so he can drive. <laughs> yeah, um, they came from UTV Stereo, and they're mainly for like side by sides yeah. and uh, okay. razors and all. So the the price was three hundred dollars, and okay. honestly, I think it's better than his regular car seat for when we go wheeling, because uh, there's a lot of bouncing going on, and I personally don't think his car seat is safe. Um, so I feel like this seat will be a lot better and safer for him this is strictly for off-road use only yeah um, it's not for riding down the road yeah it's not going to be on be a daily yeah he it's not going to be for his daily um on my in my daily or nothing like that so um we'll see we'll do a better review and better video for when we go wheeling once my prp seats are in and i'll give you guys a contact Thanks. okay so these are the harnesses that we have they're going in my jeep um we're thinking these might be just a little too big but we'll see yeah but once it gets wrapped around the real seat the real rp seats prp seats yeah dang it so we'll see i mean we do have extra uh harnesses as a backup, just in case. Um, so we'll no. Okay, okay. These, I mean, these no. might be just too big for him. Yay, let's go wheeling. You want to get on the rocks? Come on. Let me see. I don't think he would go anywhere. So we're going to try it out on our five-year-old and see um, how he fits in this little baby seat. It's not really a baby seat. It's more like a child suspension seat. 
Wow. That fits him good. Michael, how old are you? Four. No, you're not. You're five. <laughs> how old are you? Four. <laughs> no. You're five. <laughs> how old are you? Five. There Good you job. go. Three times a charm. But we do still got to put these through, to through, through, there. There, through this little hole here mm -hmm. and then up to the harness bar. And that then what it'll do, put your arms down. That then will take the harness and tuck oh, it down more ow. like that. <laughs> and then it'll, you know. Yeah. But I mean, even like this, I don't see them going anywhere, especially with that. But I can't get out. With the, the <coughs> fifth <coughs> point of the harness hooked up. Can't get out. Yeah, I <coughs> mean, even if it's... Chris is nine years old. And yeah. he fits in it too good. So let's get him in too. All right, so <coughs> here's our eight-year-old in that suspension that same child seat. seat. Yeah. And the harnesses are still the same tension, I guess you can say. I got that good. You got it? Yeah. And Christopher, how does that feel? Uh, tight, definitely, but... But it feels like it feels safe. So, with you riding in, uh, in the front seat with dad, would you prefer that extra suspension seat or sitting in a big seat? Uh, I would prefer this one because it's this is me trying to move around a lot and go forward. So, I feel like if we ever flip, <coughs> I'll be safe. Okay. Dad, too. All right. Mom, there you go, people. Sorry, I got dirty. How? We haven't even been off roading yet. Where's he gonna be at? He's gonna be right there. I thought you said put him in the center. We can put him in the center. I think the center would fit him better. You think center will fit? Yeah, we're gonna see how close these. Oh seats. yeah. All right, guys, so we got done with Wheeling yesterday, and <clears throat> I wanted to do, like, honest review of this UTV uh, kit suspension seat. As much rock bouncing as I've done, as much shaking or rattling, um, the seat actually held up really well. Um, the baby rode up front with me while well, we've done um, trails, and it's because... That's where my harness is on. I'm waiting on my back harness bar to come in so he can sit in the back where he is a lot safer. Um, but yeah, I highly recommend it. We're actually going to be placing order for two more um, because we do have two kids, uh, two more kids. <clears throat> Christopher's probably going to have one in his Jeep for when he goes wheeling and when he drives. And then Michael's going to be in it too because it... Yeah pretty much protects them so highly recommended go check them out